Hi, Jane Carlson, Division Manager of Siler Microscopes based in St. Louis, Missouri. Today I want to show you how to assemble an assistant binocular head on a surgical microscope. The three accessories that you're going to need is going to be a beam splitter, your tube coupler, and then the actual binocular head that will fit onto the tube coupler. So they're three individual parts. So first, what you will do is put on the beam splitter which we have a 50-50-20-80 beam splitter. So 50% of the light is going to go out the port when you're looking through the microscope. 100% of the light's coming through, 100% is coming back. 50% out of this, uh, the right uh, light path is gonna come out this port. So what that will do is give you more light to be able to see whatever the doctors are looking. This is your tube coupler. The nice thing with our tube coupler is you can manipulate the head really any position that the assistant wants to see. So assistant is here, move the head here. They want to do back to front. A lot of neurosurgeons like to have that. And you'll put on your binocular head. This, we have just a simple straight binocular head. Remember, we offer a zero to 220 degree inclinable head that can go on, a fixed 45 degree inclinable head, or as we have here, a zero, uh, well, this is the zero 220, that one's a straight head. So, put this in. And this is your assistant binocular head. So you got your beam splitter, tube coupler, uh, your straight binocular head. One thing I want to show you, you can rotate it here for me, rotate it here. And also one other thing, this little black circle, this will actually rotate the image so you can see exactly what the uh, head surgeon is seeing as well. Thank you.